The founder of startup Sadek, Moses Sireme, says there is a need for Africans to hold hands to promote industrial development, sustainable and inclusive social economic growth. Sereme says with Africa being home to about 1,3 billion inhabitants, need to be able to develop its own technology teams to keep up with the outside world. He therefore urges African entrepreneurs to be more creative to solve ongoing economic challenges. If you sit down and ask yourself, as an entrepreneur, where do we fit in that problem? Because an entrepreneur is somebody who looks at a problem and creates an opportunity out of the problem. So we realize that, okay, there's this traditional way of moving that we left behind, which is the rail. If we have a speed train that leaves Johannesburg, go to Khaboroni within one hour, 30 minutes, and then leaves Khaboroni and comes to Winhook within three, hour, three hours, and leaves um, Windhoek to suck up month in the next 45 minutes don't you think we're going to see a movement in africa in, in in the region that's where now we're talking numbers the deputy minister of industrialization and trade verna senimbo says that it is time for africans to embrace their business ideas going forward us coming here this morning is to come and put our pillars to make our africa more stronger because we believe that it's us to make it happen. It's us to change the mindset. We always believe if somebody come from some of these European countries to come and present this whole, somewhere even going to stand outside, we need to change from this mindset. We are being used to go there, give our good ideas, but when our fellow Africans come, share the good ideas with us, we start to question them. Like, ah, is it worthwhile for me to go there? It is. It is. Because it's us making it even happen there in Europe. And this is what the participants had to say. The challenges that I am facing as upcoming entrepreneur is um, doing a business alone. It's really a hard thing and when it comes to clients, I really have to push it harder to walk door to door to look for clients. And um, finance, when it comes to machines, I don't have a bigger machine to, to do a lot of products or a lot of an amount per day. The challenge that I'm facing here, it's uh, to get the products into the market. I really have the products in the workshop, but I can't access the market, I can't access the shelf. That's what is challenging right now.